Hello, thank you so much for your purchase of the special reading. I really, really appreciate it. And thank you to everyone who decides to watch this video. I will know it. I appreciate that as well. You are a Capricorn slash Aquarius and you want to know about your love life. Now, this is my second time recording your video. The first time my camera got disconnected. Uh, with that being said, there's a possibility of you feeling uh, disconnected to your love life. Maybe you aren't really connecting with people mentally, physically, emotionally, spiritually. Um, maybe there's an issue of you having this disconnect with yourself and you trying to find yourself and uh, what you are meant to become and what you're meant to do within this lifetime. Um, I also said with the first video, um, you know what you want. You are very particular about what you want. Um, I kept getting the eye of the eagle. I know it's eye of the tiger, but I heard eye of the eagle. Um, you are very big on details. You pay attention to a lot. And I feel like that's a good quality about you. But at the same time, you can be a bit nitpicky. I wouldn't be surprised if you have Virgo within your chart somewhere. All right, but let's see what's going on. Really interesting because the majority of the of the same cards that I picked out last time are in this spread. Um, it's it's showing where you want love. Um, you want someone who's going to make you feel complete, and you're able to make him feel complete. Um, you love men who are tra traditional and providing. Um, but I'm seeing how there's sadness with you because you aren't, you aren't getting what you want and you feel like you deserve it. Um, you try to stay optimistic about your future, but I'm still seeing how there's how there's still sadness with childhood. I remember I said this for you a long time ago and I don't want to be too discreet about it, but I remember I told you something in regards to your childhood and your parents. For some reason that's still showing up to you. I feel like you have issues with um, people leaving your life. Like you want to know why. You want to try to make them change their mind. And I do feel like eventually you just say, fuck it. If you aren't, you know, give me what I want, then buy. But I feel like that bothers you. And, and I see where you kind of hold all that in. Um, I'm still picking up on some weakness with your, um, with your heart chakra. Also, you may, um, have issues with your crown and root chakra. There may be issues in regards to your career. Um, I, I keep picking up, um just some health issues that you need to take care of not anything severe but just um normal digestive issues um and also headaches as well the cards are saying that you have to be a little bit patient find out what you want to do with your career there's a there's a particular card that i'm seeing right here the three of wands for some reason i'm picking this up as career like you needing to understand what you want to do with career and how you need to maintain your career to the point where it's going to make you happy because i'm seeing how you're going to find love through career or through the transit of another job is what's being shown to me um mr right the man that you want will come into your life but it's just a matter of time Right now you're being hit with, well, not, not being hit. You're meeting men who are testing you. Some have potential and some are just not even worth it. The angels, they want you to understand what it is that you really want and what you are accepting as well. You still have some growing to do when it comes to the self. And once again, just healing childhood. I'm not sure random I'm not sure if you are upset with mother 
or you are afraid of going through what mother went through that's showing up to me really really strong you think too much about your love life it's like why am i not married well, like why haven't i got what i want yet you think too much about that and that makes you question yourself and you shouldn't do that the angels they're like wait love will come to you just wait you are beautiful don't ever question that you are confident you need to be you need to be a little bit more confident though but don't question your beauty you are beautiful okay once again I, I keep getting this energy of like the disconnect i'm not sure if you're disconnected to yourself but like there's this disconnect this weird disconnect that's going on with your energy it's like mentally you need to tell yourself i'm going to get what i want it's just a matter of time get your get yourself back on track yeah Find, find out what you're meant to do with your career. You are meant to have some sort of proactive, athletic type of career. That's what's being shown to me. But I'm just seeing where you're just in this energy of repairing yourself. Repairing yourself. Knocking out what, what's unneeded and understanding what needs to be built. That's what's being shown to me. Um, you will find love. You will. It's just a matter of time. It's just a matter of time. The angels are also saying, um, don't accept too much. If you know that they're going to waste your time. And when you tell them, hey, I want to get married. I'm not trying to come out strong. I want to get married. I want a family. If you aren't ready for that, then bye. Um, if they stick around, awesome. You know, if they are kind of wishy-washy, like, oh, I don't know. Cut it off right then and there. Cut it off right then and there. Okay. You deserve better. But stop, stop rushing it. Stop rushing the process. That's what you're doing. You're rushing the process. Once again, you will find love. You just got to weed out the, the little boys and, and grow from within. Honestly. Learn to heal yourself from your childhood. I see you being fine, but you know it's going to take some time for you to be with who you want to be with. But really, honestly, I'm seeing how your career, you needing to better your career, and that's going to help you with your love life for some reason. Okay? But hopefully you enjoyed this reading. Good luck with everything, and I shall talk to you again soon, love. Take care. Bye.